was um, in a relationship with my ex-girlfriend and uh, she abused me by starting from um, saying nasty things about me. And then uh, the violence escalated because she started to pinch me. She once nearly threw a chair at me and she also went to grab a knife to threaten me. So I felt that um, I couldn't bear with it anymore. Another difficulty was that I actually didn't tell that I was in a relationship with a girl to my family. I was so lonely and I didn't know where I could find help. I seeked help, but there's still discrimination. So I was afraid of coming out. I was afraid that I would probably lose my job. And I was um, very lonely at that time because I felt like I couldn't tell anybody about my case when I needed help. Uh, when I approached Last Corner for the first time, I felt kind of relieved because finally um, somebody understands my situation and that I could actually finally get someone to help me. They had a 24-hour hotline and they um, talked to me, sort of like they kind of like counseled me and to ease my emotional <laughs> status at that time. And then they also helped me find a registered social worker to help me with my case because I didn't know what I could do. So they were really like a family and a friend that would always give me support when I needed the most. In Les Corner, I am now one of their volunteers and we are fighting for LGBT rights. So even though you can't come out, just don't be afraid to find help because I'm sure that there will be some organization or there must be someone who is willing to support you and who can really help you. My name is Jessica. I am a LGBT member and I would advise those women who are experiencing domestic violence that they should find help as soon as possible so they could experience a new life again.